Hey guys, it's Florian. So today I'm going to be doing a clothing hat video. Woo! And yes, I'm fully aware it is the middle of November and I'm wearing a cap. Screw it. Um, yes, let's get started. So I have a bunch of clothes on the floor that I am going to be picking up and talk to you guys about. Um, there's about five pieces of item, five pieces, five, five. I'm going to be doing, talking about six item clothing pieces, things. Um, yeah, let's jump right in. So I'm going to work on the head and then move my way downwards. Boom. First clothing hack. Hack? Yeah, hack. Um, is snapbacks. This is one I got from Comic Con. Um, I went in October and... Oh, hello. Um, I got this one from... H and M. It's got some cat hair on it because I have a cat, um, and they're literally just plain snapbacks. This one's a little bit bigger, um, and that's one as you can probably tell. And this, this is actually a, just an ordinary cap, super dry. Um, eh, but I mean, yeah, because this one is a little bit bigger, it makes me look more manly. Um, I suggest getting caps like these, um, like the darker coloured, um, just mainly because A, they're more manly, B, they go with pretty much anything. This goes with pretty much anything, um, and you can wear it pretty much all year round. <laughs> this I can't really wear backwards, just mainly because it's too big, but these certainly help me pass. The hat of pass. We'll just wear all of them. A. <laughs> um. So yes, um, so that is item clothing, clothing of item, item of clothing, item of clothing number one. Think about. Um, I'm trying to do this in like as many as few uh, shots as possible. Um, next one is big hoodies. Now, I should have two big hoodies. Yep, yeah, I have two big hoodies. So I have this one. These are plain lazy. Again. Helps me pass, and it's also really good, especially when it comes to dysphoria, like chest dysphoria. So if you get baggy hoodies, they are brilliant for like chest dysphoria because they cover it up. Like they just feel so baggy and nice. Um, so I have this one. It says you want? I have like a whole load just over there, like in that cupboard. Um, this one I got from Primark. I absolutely love Primark hoodies. They're not very thick, which is really good, especially in a country like England, because like. Most of the year round you can wear this because it's nice and thin. Um, and it was Captain America. These were from Primark and they were £10. So they're really, they're really not that expensive. Um, and it's been greased because I don't bother to fold my clothes because I can't be fucked. Um, but again, like I said, they cover up your chest. Next thing, coat. Um, this is the best coat is a Parker coats because... They're like real nice and I have kind of a plaid in my hood um, with some fur, like not too much fur um, and a nice little fur. Uh, this is actually from New Look, um, so it's from the women's section. Um, I do have to say about the women's section is these little tabs like on the inside of the coats, they come quite long. M female coats have them, male coats don't. So what I or my mother practically did is we just trimmed them. So they're originally like really, really long and then we trimmed them. So that's what that side looks like. That's, I mean, you can trim them completely, but my mum said my mum refused to trim it completely. I didn't trust myself with scissors. So, yeah, so these make you feel more manly and also they're good because if you do them up, they also cover up your chest. So if you're feeling slightly dysphoric, they're great and they're great for all year round. I took this on holiday with me and also they have what I call man pockets. Their pockets are mahoosive. Like I have, I don't, I don't know where I put it, but it's like a booklet. I managed to fit a booklet in one of these pockets. I also managed to fit a t-shirt in one of these pockets. Um, they're fake. The zip ones are fake. Um, so are these. But these ones are massive. Um, so that's great. Um, Another item clothing is binders. Um, I might need to get these out the door. Uh, binders. Now, 
if you're not allowed binders, um, what I use is sports bras. Um, I have two dark blue ones. I'm actually wearing one right now. Um, I have two dark blue ones, then a white one as well. Um, just sports bras. I'm not quite... This is a size 8 woman's, like it's, but they're really small. Like, I have a really small chest, so it's all fine. Um, like, I can, like, these don't really, like, they do the job. Um, but obviously not as good as a binder would, hence why I'm where the camera position is. But what I really like about these sports bras, they're Slazenger. They're, like, the real deal. These are the hand-me-downs. Um, so these have, like, I have two older sisters, so these have probably been used with all of my sisters. 62% cotton, 29% polyamide. Whatever that is. Great thing about these is that they are adjustable. So these are really, really good. I often find that if you, when you put them on, pull them up like with the straps as far as they go back and like along the side as well. Oh, excuse me. And also if you um, like put them halfway up, um, your chesticles, halfway up your chesticles, um, so just where the nipple is, or just below that, um, and then again pull them up as tight as they can, as round as they can, um, it gives the best results. I mean, for me personally, that's what I find. Um, like this side is totally fine because I have uneven, I have an uneven chest because, sorry, that was the cat jumping down from the windowsill. I have an uneven chest um, because of my scoliosis, um, which I don't think I've really talked about on this channel. Um, last item of clothing. Yep, last item of clothing is joggers. Woo! I actually have two pairs of joggers. I have these, and then I have darker, like a poo brownie grey colour. Um, pretty much exactly the same as these. Um, they're great. These are a size 10, Harry Potter. Again, from the women's section, because I got these before I was manly man. Um, these are great because, again, for dysphoria, like bottom dysphoria, I guess. Um, I'm not allowed to wear these out, like my mum refuses to let me wear these outside the house. So they're great for just lounge around the house. They're also great when you're feeling, like, a little, I, know, I know this is totally unrelated, but if you're feeling a little bit low um, or a little bit down, these are great because they're just so snuggly. And you can do positions in them that you can't do in jeans. Um, and they're great. Like if you get home and you're feeling really low and you're feeling really dysphoric, chuck on some joggers and a baggy hoodie. You are literally sorted. Oh, and like a hot cup of tea or something. Um, and you're literally sorted. Um, your binder as well. Um, so, yeah, sorry about the seven minute long video. Um, but that is everything. If you have any other suggestions... Feel free to put them in the comments below. Any video suggestions, again, put them in the comments below. And I will hopefully read them and do them. Um, I try to do all video suggestions that I get. Not that I've had any. Um, but I do try to do them, as many as I can. Um, so I will do them. It's just... I'm in lower six now, so I'm 17. I'm currently doing A-levels, so I need to fit them in with A-levels. And No offence, but exams come first. But I shall see you in my next video. Bye, guys.